Power carving is an absolute blast, but it can be dangerous, so it's important to take a few tiny steps to help you carve as long and as safely as possible. So here are a few tips to get you started. Number one is to get yourself a nice apron. This one's a canvas one. They have them in leather as well. These are great because they're gonna give your body a layer of protection. If you drop a tool, it's gonna hit your apron and it's gonna bounce off. It's not gonna get caught up in your shirt and start twisting. Number two is a full face mask. Now this is my preferred mask. I like to make sure that my nose, my mouth, and my eyes are fully covered. If the full face mask does not work for you, you can get yourself some goggles and a half face mask and that's gonna keep you nice and protected and you're gonna still be able to wear your glasses. So the last thing I really think is important to talk about is your hearing. You're gonna to wanna to make sure you get yourself something that's gonna be a noise canceling headphone, whether it be in the ear or on top of the ear. It's important to protect your hearing. Some bonus tips, make sure you keep your tools unplugged when you're changing your burrs. You don't wanna accidentally click the button and turn this on while your hand is on it. And make sure that you're wearing closed toe shoes to keep yourself protected. Our last tip is to secure your piece in a clamper vise whenever possible. I hope this video was helpful. Next video, we're gonna be talking about all the different tools that Sabretooth offers and what power tools you need to be able to use these properly.